we are talking about tools and the stuff you need for your house. What's up, Rach? We are up here at my house in the Catskills. We wrote a book about what children can find <laughs> inside of the toolbox, and now it's adult. Everyone's gotta have this. <laughs> Gloves are key. Yeah. Splinters suck. I've gotten them under my nail. I've gotten them in my hand. It's taken days to get them out. And there's a ton of different types. Like these are really tight fitting and they have rubber throughout. Uh, really good for gripping and when you're working with uh, finer and smaller materials. And you've got stuff for like demolition yeah, no. that have padded palms and just a lot more uh, abrasion resistance. You know, having those safety tools on top of all of the tools that we're showing you, it's really, really important. Safety goggles should go without saying, but I'm saying it yes. anyway. Have to, have to say it, <laughs> absolutely. When you start saying, hey, let's start upgrading items that aren't gonna fit inside of your toolbox, then you start getting into the power tools. A really awesome multi-purpose tool that's pretty inexpensive. This is a small, probably one of the smallest air compressors you can get. I just call it a multi-purpose tool because it comes with a number of attachments. This one in particular is for uh, blowing sawdust or cleaning up a job site. I've got something for filling up car tires. It's got uh, different attachments so you can blow up the kids' pool toys and whatnot. I was just gonna say that. I think for all the parents out yeah, there, absolutely. We, we don't wanna sit there and just nonstop blow that up for hours. You get something like this, in no time you're blowing that up yeah. and you can do a lot of other work with it as well. But this is something that's, you know, like a hundred bucks and it's got 90 PSI. So the amount of pressure that's in here is substantial, meaning when you go to fill up your car tire, it's gonna take about 30 seconds as opposed to that little thing that you plug into your cigarette lighter in your car and you wait about 10 minutes to get it done. <laughs> so that's why you're gonna go ahead and invest in something like this. Now that I guess we're getting into the springtime, we're gonna talk about getting into using some of, of your blowers. Now, this is a battery operated cordless. It's really super easy to use. Battery comes on and off, super simple. It's got some power to it. I mean, I got work to do. I mean, I, I might, <laughs> Anthony might have me blow the entire driveway here. The reason why I like using this handheld one, when I'm just doing quick cleanup, so I'm talking the, the, the driveway, patio, walkways, this is super easy. And then of course, a chainsaw, you can have something come down across the driveway or you have a tree that, that falls at the edge of your property yeah. and you want to be able to clean it up. It's really easy to use, it's lightweight. It's got, you know, the safety bump guards that, that they're all required to have these days. Uh, you know, I bought it for one specific task. I got that task done and I said it was worth the investment. I have used it at least 20 times since then and I would highly recommend putting one of these uh, in, in the garage. So that covers it, guys, from us to you. Hope you enjoy the spring. Get outside, enjoy that sunshine. Much love.